Hey, what's up, YouTube, and welcome back to another TPX Reviews. Today's review is Ray's Energy, again, but Watermelon Frost is the flavor today. And, uh, yeah, so quick off to bat, I wanted to address something. That my, it was my buddy Landon uh, that actually requested or mentioned that I should look up this drink. Not Aaron. Sorry, Aaron. You've, uh, you know, I gave you credit for something else, I, I think, so we should be good, right? Cool. So, Landon... Thank you very much. Um, very neat uh, energy drink we got here. Uh, I'm going to speed through this review, though, for sure, because, well, we know it's got clear for a color, and, um, you know, all the stuff on the back of the can is the same. All we're doing here is the taste and documenting that, yeah, the can's pretty cool. So, after we got through the introductory video, uh, which was, you know, me going through the story i did i did receive a pretty decent boost of energy uh yesterday it wasn't as significant as the first time i had it but it was it was pretty awesome so here we go we got a really awesome looking red can with black up here this kind of reminds me of like i don't know this 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 can's packaging is just really cool it just it reminds me of something you would find um, like a new 90s toy or something. All these drinks, they just remind me of toys. They, like, uh, it's just like, um, it's pretty much like as if you went to a toy store and, like, there was this new cool action figure or new toy in, in, uh, or a remote control car, and, like, they always use something cool with the, um, with the packaging to kind of like, hey, here's the red, here's the red RC car, here's the yellow RC car, and then depending on which color you pick is also the the um, the frequency. So like, you know, to in order to play alongside your friends, um, you have to buy the right frequency uh, for the car to you know, like that way they don't crisscross with each other. So. Um, Let's see if we get the light over here. For some reason, this is a, this is a focusing issue going on here because the lighting has just been dark these past couple days. It's been a little bit dreary. Um, daily value not established. Okay, so the, that's interesting. They have normally you see per, percentage of your daily value. They're just flat out telling you, hey, daily value not established. Um, so that's interesting. So take that bang. You got. They didn't do any. They're too lazy. They don't want to do it. They don't want to do the all the crazy math and stuff. There's a lot in here. So it's it's a crazy concoction. I got to tell them. I got to tell you that. That's definitely. Um, and in case it wasn't ridiculously obvious, but there is a kitty in the background, and she is going through one heck of a spaz. So just she's a crazy kitty. She's very vocal. All right, so crack it open. Let's check out the smell. Um, it definitely that's definitely watermelon. I don't know if it stands out as a unique watermelon, but it smells good. That's for sure. It definitely smells good. It's kind of faint, a little hard, but hard to smell for some reason. Put my nose right up to it. Nothing. Not, not really getting a. It's it's now not getting a strong watermelon. It's just it's there. It's definitely watermelon, but it's not like a you know wow knock you back type of watermelon. But uh, yeah, definitely a very good smelling candy watermelon. Um, I like that. It's pretty cool. It's very. It's good. This can, this can feels bigger, like taller, for some reason. Uh, starting to smell it from here now that I poured it out. Pretty, it's it's a pretty interestingly good watermelon smell, but I can't quite place it. It might be kind of like, it sounds weird because it's so strawberry boom, um, by Rockstar. Uh, though even though it's a whipped it's strawberry but it's got kind of the same that's the same aroma only it's not strawberry it's watermelon so it's kind of the best way I can describe it I mean I think that it pretty much nails it that really is it smells like whipped 
It smells like a whipped watermelon, which is so cool. That's a that's a cool name. I think I just invented my own. All right. Uh, so yeah, it's clear. So you can see. Oh, cool. Let's take a sip and see what we got. Mmm. Okay, now, now it tastes like watermelon. It it tastes just like Rockstar's Pure Zero watermelon. It's which is pretty predictable. It's like, oh yeah, oh, pick the most common watermelon on the market, and yeah, just no, it it does it does really taste like Rockstar watermelon. It's almost like they pretty much cloned it because you know the Pure Zero going on. The watermelon is just, it just tastes like Rockstar's watermelon. So that's pretty, that's a pretty, I'm confident in that. <laughs> um, and I'm sure you'd agree if you had it too. It's just, it. there really isn't a whole lot of watermelon energy drinks out there. And um, that's just, that's going to have to be it. <laughs> that's just, that's just going to be it. But it's very good. Um, these these are tough because I just these are dangerous. I I could honestly sit here and just forget the camera's even on and just drink this whole damn thing. So <laughs> I guess they will not waste any time. I'm gonna run away and go do that. Um, so yeah, really good, clean very crisp tasting flavor um, very good watermelon um, replacement to Rockstar not that you'd ever have a hard time finding I, I'm assuming you'd you've you'd be able to easily find watermelon Rockstar quicker than you would this you have to actually go out of your way to buy this at a GNC which is something sorry guys I totally forgot to mention yesterday so yeah Landon's the one who told me about it GNC was where you buy this um, I recommend going there and buying each individual flavor. Um, it's tempting to buy a case of any of these flavors so far. I mean, I'd easily buy a case. In fact, I'm going to buy a case. I might be the gummy worm. Um, but then again, I have to buy... I have to figure out where I'm going to find Galaxy Burst and that, uh, the white one. Uh, and I still don't remember. I think it's a purple one. I'm missing one. But, um... So I'm going to try another GNC and see if I can find it there. But uh, yeah, this is a good flavor. Good watermelon flavor. Very, very just delicious. It's got a nice, just, it comes in there. It's very refreshing. It drives your taste buds crazy. It gives you tons of energy. Um, it's just a win-win all the way around. So that's a 10. Uh, good watermelon, just like Rockstar. Um, watermelon's a 10 from Rockstar. It's a 10 here because it's pretty much a clone. But... Yeah, so it works. So it's an alternative. So, uh, yeah, pretty much that's it. TPX Reviews with Ray's Energy, uh, Watermelon Frost. Um, the frost, I think, comes from probably a Gatorade feel. It's got kind of like a frosty, like it's a nice watermelon, icy, cool thing. And there might be a little chilling sensation for all I know. I don't know. I haven't experienced it yet. But, yeah, so that's it, guys. Uh, yep, Watermelon Frost, Ray's, and uh, see you guys soon. Peace.